expanded in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason. Even Norman pulling our plug. I really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Howard! Long time no see. How's Pidgey doing? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into Feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Jeff, congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the fifth construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Just never mind. <laughs> Hey, Howard. I think I found one of Pidgey's cousins. Dusty Gray Flex? Might have just left the stain on my suit? Clarence. Guy's a little devil, but he's a charmer. Give him a pat on the head and point him towards me. He'll find his way. No problem. I'll do the same for any others I find. There's a pigeon! Don't fly away, please! I'll set my earpiece to focus on muffled voices. I'll tune my earpiece to listen for sounds of someone struggling. It is my responsibility to catch that pigeon. I can't believe I said that. Okay. Progress. Ha! A pigeon! 
And the chase is on. It's all over the news. Another battle between Spider-Man and these demon masked gunmen threatening the lives <laughs> of New York. I understand our next caller lives in the air. You're on with J. Jonah James. Yeah, um, the thing is, it all happened in a shipyard that's beginning. But these demons, either they're some kind of fanatical cult, or they just don't care. Anybody feel like they're in danger now? I hope nobody sees me doing this. Spider-Man. Off filling up. Rosa just flew home to join her brothers and sisters. Happy to help. You know these little guys pretty well, huh? Getting there. Sandra always knew him best, of course. Sandra? Oh, uh, my, my wife. Well, tell Sandra she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. Attention units. Howard's Pigeon. Don't run. Attention units. There's a... Come on. It's a fast one. This pigeon knows the city better than I do. Pigeon alert! It's getting away. I <laughs> love these names. Is Sandra happy to see them back? Well, uh, actually, 
Actually, she's not with us anymore. Can't, you know. Howard, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Life's for living, not moping. First thing she told me after the diagnosis. Gotta remind myself of that every now and again. Keep looking, will you? Finding the rest of these birds would really mean a lot. Thanks, Spider-Man. Pigeon target acquired. Oh, no, there it goes. I wonder if Pigeon. New York's noisy, but my mask can zero in on muffled sounds. The kind a of tied up kidnap victim might make. And that's that. Every crime tower in the city's now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate. For breakfast, for dinner, the two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah, definitely. Pigeon target acquired. Don't run! I won't hurt you! Hey, slow down! As I warned, Nostradamus-like. After Spider-Man recklessly took down Wilson Fisk without preparing for the consequences, our streets are now filled with aspiring gangsters, each trying to out-psycho the other. My next guest is lucky to have survived an armed robbery. Sir, we're glad you're okay. Thanks. It was nuts. These dudes walk in like they own the place, waving guns around. Appalling. When a businessman is afraid to make an honest living. Yeah, it was a lightsaber that Spider-Man came along and stopped him. Weren't you listening? He caused the problem! I did... Forgive me for raising my voice. I'm emotional at the thought of what you went through. Jared, our call is getting shaken. Let's let him go. I'm fine. Goodbye! Black cars are in pursuit of a vehicle refusing to pull over. All units be advised, a kidnapping was just reported. Proceed to Morningside Heights. Oh, come back, little birdie! Spider-Man, I, 
I can't believe it. Whole family's reunited. No sweat, Howard. These birds are lucky to have you. I try. Sandra was always better with them. They're her birds, really. Well, now that she's gone, they're yours. Feels like a part of her lives on that way, you know? I definitely know. You're a good man, Howard. Anytime you want to stop by and see the family, <laughs> feel free. Darren says he misses you. Thanks again, Spider-Man. <laughs>